Good morning, everyone. I guess good afternoon. It's like one o'clock now, but whatever. It is uh, Wednesday, October twenty eighth, and I've been kind of quiet on the page lately. Um, I have about a hundred different reasons, but I've been fine. Um, I know I probably sound a little bit down right now. It's I'm not. I've just work's been kind of stressful and trying to manage it all and I'm fine just it's going to sound a little lethargic in this video but anywho um I have made several videos since my last post but I've deleted them all <clears throat> there's been a variety of reasons for that but the main thing I, I wanted to talk about that I kept second guessing was we had a, a meeting um the meeting I attend once a month in Fort Wayne for We the Living. It's an, it's, it's an amazing support group. And the last session I had there, that we had there, was very rough. Um, and, you know, there are a lot of very, very rough stories told. And, you know, a lot of things happened. I, I almost had an anxiety attack in there. And I, I did my best to control it. You know, and it was... You know, I, I didn't do anything stupid, thank God, but um, I, I kept wanting to tell the story, you know, what happened. And I respect the people that go to that group a lot and the people that run it. And no matter what I did, no matter how sensitive I was to not, you know, sharing too many details, I just felt like I was crossing a line. And that's not at all what I wanted. Um... And then even when I tried to talk about how, like, it made me feel, I just, I couldn't get around the fact that I felt like I was betraying, you know, the trust we have when we're in that room together. So, uh, that was, that was the main reason for my, my, uh, just not being able to post a video. So, you know, it was all a good thing in the end. I mean, I love it when people are able to, you know, come to a place like that and, you know, whether it's, you know, their 800th time being there or their first, you know, seeing the courage these people have in that room, just being able to tell their stories is inspiring. And while sometimes, and the phone. Okay, so I had to pause for the phone. This is how things have been with me lately. It's crazy. <laughs> um, not sure where I left off, but the point is... Um, Aside from, you know, the whole dilemma I had with, you know, wanting to make that video, I, uh, two other factors are in place there. The first is that I've got some speeches coming up that I've been reaching out to some, uh, other professionals in the field, um, to try to f get these speeches the best they can. Uh, this is a first run for me in this regard. So I I've been kind of stressing out about that. I'm getting down to the wire on the first one. Um, I think I've got like a week and a half left before that one. So something I definitely need to get finalized quickly. Um, and then the other is I, I kind of wanted to just see without my constant presence, what the Facebook page would do. And I didn't want to, you know, make it run too long, but it just was curious if people would continue to post without me posting. And that answer, that question has been answered. Um, there's been a lot of little motiv motivational memes posted, which is always awesome. Um, uh, a few of you have posted a vi some videos here and there, which obviously is, you know, more helpful than you'll ever know. Um, but that being said, please ignore my somber tone. It, I, there's really nothing wrong. I'm just burnt out from work. And I mean, this page hasn't really stressed me out a whole lot. So, um, but I would like to uh, post my, uh, at least a rough sketch of my, my speeches. I've got some speeches for a youth group coming up and then a, the high school here in Columbia City. So I'd like to kind of post those to you guys, probably just in the same format, and, uh, you know, get some feedback from you guys. I've got uh, uh, some other, you know, people who have been doing this kind of thing with speeches and stuff like that for a long time that are going to reach out to me, hopefully today or soon, um, 
to kind of see, you know, where I'm at versus what they've done and, you know, maybe try to combine those and take the, the best parts from both. But uh, it should be in busy next week or so, that's for sure. So I guess that's it, guys. I don't want to rant and rant forever. I know it's been a while since I made a, a video, but um, everything's good with us. I haven't been battling uh, any depression really at all lately. I was a little rough after that We the Living class, but I was able to bounce back pretty quickly. So all is good with me. I hope all is good with you guys. I love the dedication you guys give to this page, even if it's just finding something inspirational and posting it. You know, a lot of those are, some of them can be generic, but I, I don't look at it like that way at all. It's, it's, it's like if that one little post can hit somebody and get them to think, you know, positive thoughts or just get them in a line of thinking that, you know, may not have been intended, but can be positive. Those are good things. So I don't want it to become like a, that's all we do is just post these inspirational posts. You know, I'd like to see some stories posted, you know, you know, examples you hear from across the country, you know, someone, someone else's survivor story that they're, you know, that they've made public, um, you know, some resources posted for people to, to do this or do that or anyway um i say this a lot guys but i'm always looking for suggestions and you know ways to make this page more interactive um and ways to branch out so feel free to send me a private message or post it just on the page um so on and so forth also one final thing i want to talk about we have had a flood of just disgusting people on on that page that want to post you know buy you know sunglasses and they link some probably bullshit site you know or i saw a couple lately where it was like marlboro's giving away cartons of cigarettes get out of here and i have been on it i've been deleting those posts but if you join this and you post something like that not only will i block you I can do that instantly. I've got this on my phone. I've got all the different apps I need to manage this thing perfectly. I will delete it. But aside from that, shame on you. Shame on you. You self... I could just say some vulgar things right now. It pisses me off. You people are pathetic. This is not a, a, a garage sale Facebook group. This is a support group for people who have been through some traumatic experiences. And if you join this and you happen to see this video before you make your stupid fucking post, piss off. I will delete you and I have no respect for you whatsoever. I have never said something like that abrasive on this page and I don't want it to become that. But just know that you're a despicable person. So that's that. <laughs> I'll try to smile to make that not seem so rough. I love all of you. Thank you so much for your dedicated support to this page. And uh, we're going to keep growing. Love you guys. Bye-bye.